Here's how to fix missing contacts in Android. Now, if you used to have a bunch of contacts, but now you find that they're missing maybe in WhatsApp or in the contacts app, I'm gonna show you how to get them back. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks guys. Now, the first thing we're gonna do is swipe up from here and navigate to your contacts app. So tap on contacts here. And now the first and the easiest solution is just to tap on the three dots at the top, right? And then tap on the view by storage location. Now on here, you can see I have a number of accounts here, but if I switch this to just we'll say my Google account, it will just show the contacts in my Google account. It will not show all of my contacts. However, I can just tap the three dots, hit view by storage, and make sure it's selected to all contacts at the top. Now, after I've done that, if it still doesn't work or fix it, tap on the three dots again at the top, right? And we'll tap on settings at the very bottom. Now, from here, all you need to do is scroll down because you can see towards the bottom is sync contact account. So just tap on that. You can see I have a number of email accounts that are already synced up with bringing in my contacts. So it says tap to sync now. I can just tap on it and tap on it and tap on it. Or I can always turn on auto sync to just perpetually have it sync up my contacts. That's another option that you have. Another option is let's go back out of here and go into your settings instead. So swipe up and go to settings. Now from here, we're gonna to go to apps. So scroll down until you find the section for apps. Tap on that. And now we'll scroll down to the bottom. For instance, if you're using WhatsApp and ow, all of a sudden they're just phone numbers but not the contact names, you can just tap on WhatsApp here. And for permissions, tap on that and make sure contacts is added to this list. So tap on contacts and make sure it's set to allow. This will allow WhatsApp or whatever app that you're using to bring in and use all those contacts instead of just having the phone numbers associated with that specific contact, but not the actual contact name. Now, after we've done that, the next thing that we will do is go back out of here, go all the way back to the beginning. We're gonna tap on software update and download and install. A lot of times an update to the Android operating system will fix issues or bugs. And by doing so, it will also restart your phone. You'd be surprised how many times bugs or glitches are fixed just by restarting or rebooting your phone because it could have been up and running for days or weeks without a proper reset. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks guys.